All right, all right, ladies, gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, how are you doing? I hope you're doing all right. We have quite a bit of exploring to do, so here's uh, here's hoping we don't get lost in the middle of it, or you know, just get viciously savaged by a bunch of wild creatures. Oh my god, move out of the way, thank you. Really? How many times do I get it stuck on NPCs? What did Stellar Bay's engineer name your cannon machine? I don't rightly know. That have been Guster, I think? Guster? I'd ask him, but he fell in the machine once, so... Oof! Could call it Guster's demise? Jesus Christ! Just canned person sitting around somewhere. I read that slogan so wrong. <laughs> I read it is spread twice the seed at half the price and Jesus Christ. Okay, I can't believe I missed that. Alright, so. Um, where? Huh. Can't really tell where this is at. Wait, is it here? And I, and I, oh my god. Can't fast travel to it, so let's just run. Get some XP along the way. Hello, boys! There we go. Nope, that's not all of them. Here I go. Thank you, Pravati. Nothing personal, I swear. Oh, thank you. I don't know if those icons mean I have to repair my armor and whatnot but I probably should just regularly do that anyway. The hell was that? Let's try not to get poisoned by sulfur. Oh dear lord. Wait, what are we shooting at? Oh shit. Alright, taking a shortcut through the wilds is not always the best idea. Alright, so maybe this way to get up on the hill? Oh my god! Oh, this is a bandit camp! This is a bandit camp! Actually, let's uh, let's switch to this. All right, there we go. Yeah, you can. You've been doing it thus far. Plasma usually works. We're good to go. What is this? Light ammo? Heavy ammo as well. MSI soldiers.
Hello. Oh, they were coming real close to eating me. I'm Lenora. How you doing? You, uh, what are you doing out here? Not that I'm complaining, but I figure only marauders and animals roam around. I was just, <laughs> I'm just looking for people to save, of course. Oh, uh, well, okay. I can appreciate an adventurous spirit. Thanks for the help. I've got to pick up some things from the bay, but I run a little stand near Fallbrook. Next time you need supplies, stop by, you hear? Sure. Thanks. Did I get this? No, I didn't. Alright. So, here's ho hoping she doesn't get uh, absolutely and utterly murked on the way back there, but nothing we can really do about that. Oh, oh my. Oh, oh shit. Oh dear lord, that was a shortcut we shouldn't have taken. Oh, the bridge. Wait, that's not the bridge they blew up, is it? I hope to god it's not. Let's try to try to Skyrim our way up some mountains or find a path. Up oh, this might work over here. Oh wow. Is that a cemetery? Here they come! Oh Jesus. Oh shit, that's a lot. Alright, I guess we made quick work of that. Alright, so. Yeah, we're gonna cross the bridge just up here, and yes, this is a cemetery, okay. Incoming. Oh shit. I think this is where we killed a. No, it's not. Obviously, it's not if they're still here. Or some more bandits just moved in. Okay. Now we can pr cross the bridge. All right, so the journal. Optional retrieve Zora's team. How do we... Printing press. Is there like... There's no secondary... Yeah, there's no secondary, uh... Here, let, let's check it again. Let's see, before Graham spread his message, da 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 Still up. Still me. Travel there, get the replacement parts you recently obtained to uh, get back in working order. So where exactly... I mean, this might have been the bridge they were talking about. Or arguing about, I guess is the better word. Okay, so a dead iconoclast. Kind of 
nice hit. There we go. Okay. I don't know where her team would be. Oh shit. Did it uh there it is. And we did it. How in the hell? Alright, we'll we'll try to get in there in a minute. I wanna wipe these bandits out. Go and pop out. There we go. Incinerate. Huh. They were right on the road to Stellar Bay. What the hell is this? Oh, it's just a little sneak around. Wait a minute, maybe finding her team is a side quest. No. Okay. So, we'll see what we can do about it. Please unload. Just execute him. Covering you. Oh, that's Pravati. Yeah, I think we're all good. Despite the horrific screams. <laughs> oh no. Sit down. Sit down, big boy. Oh shit. Oh, well, I think we found him. Nioka, you're a sight right now, I'll tell you what. We are up a creek. I bet. You really come this far north for a printing press? Yeah, I know, I know, but that's the mission. Don't suppose y'all are busy right now. Uh, look for her guys. One, yeah, okay. Thank the Eternal. We could use a hand. But, we can't leave without patching these guys up. Acker here is bleeding out and Jensen can't see straight. Our medic has got our trauma kit, but we got separated. We ain't seen him in a couple of hours. Uh, any idea where he went? Yeah, on account of giving him the order. He's searching the old settlement to the north of the press. All right. So let's see where that takes us. 
Well, all we have to do to, is just not go in the printing press building and look for him. Oh, shit. Yeah, he's probably dead. Oh, this is an absolute clusterfuck. <laughs> There we go. Alright, I think we're all good. Oh yeah, he he's dead. He's real dead. Anything else? Nope. Okay, well. Let's just go get the first aid kit back to them. Any luck out there? Yeah, he's dead. Oh, fuck. Well, that's better than nothing. Thanks. We'll head out as soon as we're patched up. In we go. Okay, so they took a took a beating. Right, let's uh oh my god. There's just red dots everywhere. Alright, we should probably search around here. Oh my god, his legs are gone. It takes four? Okay. Why not? There we go. And that's how you take out a uh, small team of hostiles like a commando squad. Oh jeez, oh jeez. Sorry, I'm trying to not let him get past this. Oh boy, okay. Okay. They really want you to work for it. Oh, ripped his head clean off. don't know what that is or what it can be used for but we'll find a use for it probably bunch of kids 
cash. Can't get in there. EDL masks. Okay, so that didn't that didn't do too much for us. Final notice. Nope, that goes outside. we go. And let's just finish them off. This is just the bathroom with nothing in here. Okay. Just noshing on some canned food. Shotgun, what is this? What is this? Uh, light ammo, do need that. An office. Terry's birthday, we're leaving. Okay. Anything else of value? Nope. What's through here? Catwalk. Wait a minute. No, I, I've been in here. I passed it. I walked straight past it. Let's get to work. Okay. All is well. Let's get the hell out of here. Alright, we're good. Five bucks, I can't fast travel to the interior. What? Guess I would have lost that bet. Okay. Alright, y'all. I got your stuff, got your team. Can I talk to her too? I need to buy myself an entire. Never resort. mind. If you'll just listen. No, no more listening. No more preaching. We are losing people left and right. We need to act. Enough, Zora. I'm not putting the torch to innocent people. Do you want to bring the board's cruisers and gunships down on us, Captain? Apologies, but our situation grows dire. Our people talk of foolish endeavors. What news do you bring? Your printing press is done. Uh, if there are gunships, uh, they sure didn't stop me from landing here. The printing press is all yours. What are you arguing about? We're out of time. We need food and ammunition. We need to hit Stellar Bay while we still have the manpower to do it. That seems desperate. Are you really doing... Uh, are they really doing it better than you are? They're not. <laughs> It is. We are desperate. We're starving. My people are dying left and right. Doubtful. But we don't need much, and Sanjar isn't going to share. It is. 
Oh, okay, so that's kind of like the same thing. Yes, I know it's drastic, but it's clear that Sanjar will never cooperate. And if it's him or us, I choose us. Is it clear, though? Have you tried to talk to him? Excellent. Did you find the Van Oys? Yeah, didn't they come back? Thank the Eternal. We're one step closer to bringing the truth to every man, woman, and child in Halcyon. This plan's brilliance is in its subtlety. For the time being, let us cease our activities on the tower, lest we bring premature attention upon us. I have much to do. Articles to write, sermons to ponder. We live in such an exciting time. Let's talk later. Hey, I need to see to the wounded, but drop by the clinic when you can. I want a word. Well, I can do that now because I'm already here. Oh, but first, actually, let's increase some things. There we go. This is not the way out. Did she just kind of magically spawn at the clinic? It's not this way. I went the wrong way. That was dumb. It's like right next door. Oh, there she is. Hey, Captain. I need your help, and we ought to keep it hush-hush. Okay. You know about what happened here, right? The history of Amber Heights? No. A fella came through Edgewater once, mentioned something to my dad about pirates wiping out of town. You mean this is the same place? Right. Common belief is that the pirates fled to an old relay station that had already been abandoned, but nobody could find them. The station's locked up. But one of my people found an old data cartridge in a nearby wrapped nest. It's mostly corrupted, but I pulled a couple codes off of it. One is the code to the Amber Heights gate. I don't recognize the other, but it's similar. I bet it opens a door. A random door code doesn't sound useful, it doesn't. Uh, why are we keeping this to, our, uh, to ourselves? Okay, go to the relay station, see if the code's useful, anything else? I know it's a long shot, but if we miss something there, if you can get into that station, maybe we can get some answers. Uh... I surely do, but it's not far. And if they died in there, they died with their munitions. We'll need them. Besides, if it's filled with valuables from the aristocrats who lived here, we can pawn them off on sublight and get ourselves ahead on our food budget. Right. Just a warning. The area is infested with mantasaurs. I'd send some help, but we're, you know, preparing for war. Appreciate it. Here's the code. If it works, bring back anything you find. Supplies are best, but information's good too. If someone was behind the Amber Heights massacre, they give a lot of people around here some closure to find out who and string them up. Good luck. Watch out for the tarot's. Okay. Well, if it was pirates, I'm pretty sure they're not here anymore. Shit, if they were still alive, I might have killed them on the way out of several places. Um. So that's... Radio Free Monarch. Hold on. Oh! Oh. Well, actually, let's see if we can hit the Borst factory first. Excuse me. 
Oh, dealing with Clive is the Borst Factory one, I think. So let's do that. Okay. part of the new line shift. Don't tell me you lost your key card already. A lost card's worth two infractions, you know. Depends on what you got. But I reckon we can work something out. You know, I think I did hear something about that. All right, okay. Thanks. And we go. We can loot everything else once we, uh, you know, shoot our way out of here eventually. <laughs> oh, this is interesting. Why not? Oh my god. Oh, this thing goes whether we move or not. Where the hell am I? Let's just walk through. Let's see if we can figure out if this is a bathroom. Oh my god. Oh, that's Pravati. Right, one more time. One more time. would just be too easy if we could go straight from there. There we go. See if we can get up here without any issue, which we can. I have no clue what I just did. <laughs> but I, I think I just sexually harassed someone. Yeah. Okay. 
I am unclear as to what I just did. But that's fine. Okay, so they're still they're still clothed. So he is all the way on the other side of the factory. <sighs> Jesus. Is this the elevator? That's sealed. Where the hell is the elevator? I called an elevator. Pink slip protocol on security automatics. Oh my god. I can't hack it. Which kind of sucks. That would honestly be great. Let's, uh, let's do this as stealthy as possible, and if we get caught, I believe those are the number of chances we have to just, like, explain it away. Which is three. sailing thus far. Whoa now. And just what do you figure you're doing up here? These are my private quarters, friend. I don't allow tours up here. I don't allow tours ever on deeper consideration. You seem caught off guard. Certain things require a mess to do well. See, I was just killing some time. I prefer to prepare my dinner by my own hand. Nothing like fresh and bloody borstwurst. Right. I do own a factory known for specializing in the canning of borstwurst. On occasion, I like to imbibe other parts of the sisty pig. Did you fancy me a cannibal? Perish the thought. No, I don't eat the bodies, I disappear. A joke, that last was. So, what can I do for you? Wait, so My are you a cannibal? attention is at your disposal. Is he looking at me? Oh, law. He is absolutely surely giving me the complete creeps. While I approve of your associate's cautious nature, I still teeter on the verge of losing my patience. Let us move forward with the present proceedings. By sublight, you mean Catherine, do you not? That greedy star-crossed sow. Listen, friend. The Borst King of Monarch does not negotiate with coveters. How about you bring me Catherine's severed head, and I will gift you a lifetime supply of Borst. I don't... I don't want that. You desire that I should lower myself to Catherine's level of crassness and filth? I cannot fathom how that would cotton, myself. The king built this golden monopoly brick by brick from the rubble when the corpse abandoned Monarch. No, he ain't the sort to partner up, as that requires the sharing of power and profits. You think I don't recognize human remains? You think to blackmail me? Try it. The king will grind you to bone spurs and toenails. I only meant that uh, what you do... For true? You figure she will appreciate my skills? 
they did take me years to perfect. However, I remain unconvinced she could provide the means to make the association worth my while. If you ain't noticed, I'm doing swell, ruling this kingdom on my own. Uh, your staff doesn't appreciate you. They slack on the job. They gossip behind your back. Catherine wants the factory. Would I kill you or convince you? Uh, matters uh, little to either of us. I do admire a properly ruthless individual. If it will keep that sublight sow off my back, then it's an undoubtedly worthwhile pursuit. The king is interested. John Hancock me on the dotted line, friend. I will even <clears throat> give her a cut of the profits, requiring she keeps clear of my short hairs. It, a fair and handsome deal is what it is. Tell Catherine she is permitted to dump the bodies each and every Tuesday, precisely at 3 a.m. I can always no, uh, no. That's mm. great. Why not? Easier for who? You need knocking. <laughs> All right, let's get out of here. Just cause he was, he was, he was legit freaking me out a little bit. <laughs> Are we good? We good. What the hell? Oh no, I, I don't want to, I don't want any of that. <laughs> I don't know what it is. What the hell, what did that do? What did that do? Okay. I have no clue where I am. But really, I killed him for the simple fact that he was a creepy, arrogant, probably cannibal. Okay, so... Come on, give me back to Fallbrook, please. All right, let's go talk to Catherine. If he wasn't so Uncle Fester levels of creepy, I just I would have left him alive and been done with it. Please say the Oda corpse you're wearing is Clive's. Slaughterhouse Clive is deceased. Huh. Not much boast to that declaration. Am I to take that to mean you didn't kill him? They say desecration is a virtue. How many knuckleheads did you send to murder him? Of course it was me. Hired more than were successful, can tell you that. Still, this ought to compensate for your troubles. And take an aromatic. You stink like Sisty Pig. Thanks. I'll presume you mean Arthur, the one you sent scurrying back like a sprat with his tail cut off? Reckon I'm happy he's alive? I'd be happier if the marauders who botched my drop were dead. OK. 
Okay. Sweet. That's all good. Okay, so... Journal. Still got a bunch of things to take care of. So is this relay station the same place as... No, it doesn't feel like it. Alright, here it is. We've been through here already a couple of times. I think. Oh, no, no. This is the one place we couldn't get into. Oh, wow. Sublight thug. Hemlock's eye patch? Okay. Keep that. Nope, nope. What the fuck? There we go. Alright, um. Is there a vending machine in here? No. Supposed to? Anything else? Work orders, closure of work order. I did miss this. Amber Heights. Really? All right, Zora. Didn't let me read the data pad, so just here it is. Welcome back. You find anything out there? Let's see. These are old. Looks like correspondences between the pirates. Some bits here, some there, some... Wait. This... This one's got the Amber Heights gate code on it. Just like the one I found earlier. And here's... A letter. Wait, this is from Graham. Oh, of all the... Captain, he gave them the gate codes. Oh, shit. Watch it. That's our leader you're talking about. My friend. I know he's got his head in the clouds, but... I always believed there was a core of good there. What the hell happened to live and let live? Thank you for bringing this back, but I need some time. I gotta think. I'll let you know if I figure something out. Okay. Go take a walk, Captain. I'll find you once my head's on straight. Well. I don't think there's anything left on Stellar Bay, or not Stellar Bay, Monarch to do other than Radio Free Monarch. So, let's check this. So, ladies and gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, when we return, we're going to see about finally getting to Hiram. So I thank you so much for watching, and I will see you all next time.